Hey everyone, welcome back. Uh, this will be my final Simpsons game review. Uh, I don't have any more Simpsons games, just three. I used to have Simpsons Wrestling, but uh, I don't know what happened to that. Um, but here is my all-time favorite Simpsons game. This is Simpsons in the form of a game done in the perfect way, except for the dialogue. The dialogue was ripped straight from Road Rage. But, uh, the story is as follows. Springfield's biggest driving cat is daughter, let loose. Drive yourself crazy in lawless fender benders and chaotic head-on collisions as your favorite Simpsons character. Unbuckle your seatbelt and set out on foot to investigate creepy crop circles and a diabolical conspiracy threatening to obliterate Springfield. Drop that donut and grab the wheel. Over 50 mayhem filled missions. Actual voiceover by the Simpsons cast. Authentic story by the Simpsons writers. Bonus unlockables and multiplayer action. The multiplayer on this is a wonky. Uh, it's a racing only multiplayer. But if you're playing it on one player, you're playing the main game. Uh, you play as Homer for the first level, uh, Bart for the second level, Lisa for the third, Marge for the fourth, Apu for the fifth, um, Bart for the sixth, and Homer for the seventh. Uh, you don't play as Maggie, which upset my aunt because she loves Maggie. Uh, so, what is The Simpsons Hit and Run? Think of Grand Theft Auto, but you don't kill people when you play as a Simpsons character. Sounds like a weird idea, because it is, but it works. I had so much fun with this game, I still haven't unlocked everything. I don't... I've, I've beaten this game uh, three times, and I still haven't unlocked everything. I want to unlock all the bonus cars. I want to unlock all the outfits. And... You want to talk about a game that should have trophies? Put this on the PS3, like make a Simpsons Hit and Run HD. Put put trophies on it, and people will have a blast because uh, you can you can probably get a trophy for completing all the bonus missions, completing all the races, completing all the side quests which there's only a couple of side quests, uh, beating each level with all seven uh, objectives for each level. Like, there's tons to do in this game. So, I think bringing this to the PS3 would be an excellent uh, choice. But, we'll probably never get it because the PS4 is out and everybody's got that. Um, they're, uh, pretty much, uh, what it takes from Grand Theft Auto is the free roaming aspect and the fact that you can steal any car, but you don't actually steal the car, you commandeer the car. Like, uh, you will be in the front seat, but you won't be in the driver's seat when you steal another car. The only time you're ever in the driver's seat is if it's your own vehicle. But you can control the other car when you take it. Uh, you just won't be in the driver's seat. Um, Bart's vehicle is the is the paper rocket. Uh, Marge's vehicle is the Caminero. Like these are the main vehicles. Uh, Homer's is the family sedan. Lisa's is the Electorus. Um, Apu's, I forget what it is. 
I forget what it's called. I know what the car is, but I forget what it's called. Um, yeah, those are the cars. Grandpa's car is a army uh, jeep with rockets on it. So that's pretty cool, but you don't get to play as a uh, grandpa, you just get to drive the vehicle. Um, but overall, I thought this was a terrific game. Definitely worth the time and money. If you're a Simpsons fan, pick this up. If you're a Grand Theft Auto fan, pick this up. If you're a Grand Theft Auto and Simpsons fan, pick this up. Because if it doesn't uh, appeal to the Simpsons fan in you, it will appeal to the Grand Theft Auto fan in you. And if it doesn't appeal to the Grand Theft Auto fan in you, it will probably appeal to the Simpsons fan in you. But I'm a Simpsons fan and a Grand Theft Auto fan, and I thought this was good for it. I never thought there would be a game like this. Like, yeah, you can fight, but you never actually kill people. Uh, you earn coins instead of dollars, um, and the more vehicles you unlock, the better the game gets. It says, save Springfield by car by foot by the seat of your pants. So, anyways, uh, anyways, that's my review over The Simpsons Hit and Run. Nothing special about the disc, just uh, Bart and Lisa in a car going through a ring of fire. Uh, the cover is right there. Uh, Homer about to become a victim of a hit and run. Um, all the Simpsons characters are here, so yeah, it stays true to the source material, just like Road Rage. The only thing I don't like about it is it recycles dialogue from Road Rage. So, anyways, I'll be back with an Xbox review. So, Xbox game, not the system review. Uh, an Xbox game review. So, hopefully you all are enjoying my reviews uh, today. It's fun making them, and uh, I got nothing better to do right now since it's raining. So, anyways, I'll be back with another review. Peace.